Hi YouTube, it's Autumn Beckman. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. If you like this video, please click the like button below and the subscribe button if you would like to see more videos from me and the little bell notification icon if you would like to be notified when I post a new video. My sound effects person, which I'm sure, you'll, I'm sure you will hear at some point throughout the video is Vincent, my African gray parrot. Um, <clears throat> that's all I'll say about her for now. You can watch other videos to learn more. All right, so I have an exciting video today. It's a little different than the usual ones, and I have really been looking forward to this. Um, I'm posting this on December 17th, which is a Sunday, but I'm actually filming this on December 10th, so a little more than a week earlier, and I am involved in a Secret Santa gift exchange with some of my fellow YouTubers, some of my favorite YouTubers. So there was another group that did a Secret Santa YouTube, like they were luxury YouTubers, uh, gift exchange last year. And I contacted the two people who organized that last year and they gave us our blessing to do a Secret Santa gift exchange of our own. All right, so I'm gonna get started with this. I have my holiday drink here, one of my favorite holiday drinks, champagne, and I've got that in my Waterford Crystal uh, Snowflake glass. This is from a couple years ago, and I got it last year at Marshall's for about half price because Waterford is quite pricey, and I am typically not willing to pay full price for that. Mixed in with my champagne, and, and it's not really champagne, it's a sparkly wine. So let me show you what I have here. This is Freshnet. I drink this stuff, uh, well I was about to say I drink it all the time. I drink it pretty often. I buy this all the time because it's only about $8 at our local um, big chain liquor store. And it's really good. I, it's pretty rare that I spend a lot of money on a bottle of champagne. That has to be a, um, a very special occasion. <clears throat> so I recommend Freshnet. And I get the extra dry, the dry and the brute are also great. And I've been mixing this elderflower in with it, St. Elder. Now, let's get to it. Here is my box from my Secret Santa. I already know who my Secret Santa is because I organized the exchange part for the group. So my Secret Santa is Rod, um, who is Doc Luxury of Men on Bags. And <clears throat> they are up in Minnesota very cold up there um, it's a little chilly here it's in the 40s here it gets a little bit colder than that here in houston but not a whole lot this is pretty wintry for us all right i'm gonna cut into this so i'm gonna say up front and maybe this is silly to say i don't know but i always get really self-conscious when i'm opening gifts in front of people i I like it when somebody, um, when I see somebody open a gift, whether it's from me or not, and they're really excited about it and they love it no matter what it is, I'm like, I don't know, I get self-conscious about my reaction in front of people. So I just want to say um, up front that if I seem weird, it doesn't mean I don't like anything. It's just self-consciousness. Hopefully doing the YouTube videos will help with that because I feel like that's helped me um, a little like socially anyway I'm kind of socially awkward anyway <laughs> okay here is my card it says to autumn all right I'm gonna open this up and here's my card oh happy day and let me read this I'm sure he's okay with me reading it because he's a youtuber too and he knows these things oh boy I have to get my glasses Okay, I got my glasses, and they're in my beautiful Louis Vuitton glasses case, which I still love so much. It's one of my favorite pieces. So, glasses on so I can read. Oh, happy day. Autumn, I hope you enjoy the goodies packed in this box. It's a mix of things I thought you would like, but it's also a mix of things that I like as well. Happy holidays and best wishes. Sincerely, your secret Santa, Rod, a.k.a. Doc Luxury. And there it is. Pause it and read it if you want, if you don't believe me. All right, so it, this is a heavy box. So I think, um, I'm hoping this is a flat postage box because it is very heavy. It's got to be 10 pounds. <sighs> okay, 
I'm, that's why I'm not going to like pick it up and, well, I'll pick it up in a second. Ooh, wow, there's a lot in here. Ooh, look at all this. Okay. Look at all that. Oh my God. There's so much in there. Let's see. I'll take out the, oh, I thought that was just filler, but there's something in here. Let's see. Last year on the other gift exchange, there were some things that were numbered. And I just want to make sure that that's not the case here. So I'm not opening something out of turn. Okay. So I'm just going to open these randomly. I'll pull them out and open a Febreze a Hawaiian Aloha scent plug, a refill. That must mean that I've got some kind of Feb thing to put this in, right? A Febreze thing to put this in. So it says Hawaiian Aloha, and it looks like it has two 45 days, 45 jours. That's French, right? Cool. I don't, I don't think I can smell it through there, but let's see. Okay, yeah. This is the thing to put them in, a Febreze plug. I definitely need this because I have animals and I also have children in my classroom. I have a bunch of little 12 year olds. Hi, some of you are probably watching because you know that I have my, my YouTube channel. Um, so this would be great in my classroom too. This would be like perfect. I was just thinking the other day that my room was getting a little stinky and uh, I could use something like that. So thank you, Rod. That'll be very, very helpful. All right. Ooh, what is this? Retro 50, 1951. Looks like a card case. Let's see. Enjoy fun products by Retro. I'm not going to read that whole thing. Here, I'll just hold it up. Doo -doo -doo. There it is. Yeah, it looks like some kind of card case. Let me open it up and see. And I need a card case. Maybe he saw that. I bet he did. Because I was talking about getting um, the Louis Vuitton Zippy coin. Zippy coin? Zippy card. It's a Zippy coin, I think. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's really pretty. I love retro stuff, too. That's very nice. It's a beautiful color. Ooh, I don't know if that's going to show up on the screen and like all the detail because it's so shiny. Yeah, you can see it. That's very pretty. Thank you so much. And it says Retro 1951 on the back. Lovely. And I love that it has this little elastic to keep stuff in place. Thank you, thank you. That'll come very handy. Now maybe I don't have to spend $400 on the Louis Vuitton thing, throwing stuff on the floor. What next? Let's see. I'll try this little box here. Ooh, candies. I have to keep these out of Baron's reach. So he, one of my dogs, you know, one of my uh, dachshunds gets into everything. And it's amazing what he can get into when we think we have Baron proofed and he still gets into it. He jumped up on the dining table where we have all the wrapping stuff and came home to find stuff everywhere. So I got some Ghirardelli's dark chocolate and some Lindor truffles. You know what? I think I've only had like one or two Lindor truffles in my whole life. I don't know why. We just never had them growing up and I've never bought them. And so that'll be good to, uh, to try that. And these are the milk chocolate truffles. I love milk chocolate and dark chocolate. Too. Ooh, more, more Lindor truffles. Yum, yum. So I look forward to trying those for sure. So these are I don't think they say what they are. They're red ones and gold ones. So these look like the the ones in here. So maybe those are milk chocolate. And then the gold might be caramel inside maybe. Yum. Thank you. What next? There's so much. I don't know what to pull out first. Let's see. How about this one? Ooh, it has tissue paper. So I don't know yet what it is. <gasps> I recognize that tissue paper. Do you? Hold on, let's see if the camera will focus on it. That is Sugarfina tissue paper. <gasps> Look. Come on. It's so bright. There we go. Bubbly bears. <sighs> so of course, my card runs out of room right in the middle of filming this. 
So I think I opened something that didn't make it on film. The last thing was the Sugarfina, and I don't even know where it stopped recording. Um, but I said that I haven't been to Sugarfina in a while, and this will really help me out because I'm running low. And he knows that I love Sugarfina, and these are some of my favorites. I mean, these are the, the classic Sugarfinas. That's what they're known for. Why is that so dark? Come on, guys. Camera. Come on, come here. Camera. Camera. Okay, the next thing that I opened came wrapped in this tissue paper and it was Bluetooth speakers. And what I said about that, that the camera didn't record, was how did you know I needed speakers? Because I was just looking for those on Amazon. So I have my laptop here and I like to play music while I'm doing stuff around the house, but I don't have any speakers. And I used to have, last year, Black Friday, I got this little wireless speaker thing from Best Buy for like $5, and it worked great until it didn't anymore. So this is perfect. This is exactly the kind of thing that I was looking for. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You saved me a search and, and some money. That's always good. So I look forward to using that for sure. Um, and it said on the back, I read the back too a little bit, big sound, small size, it has stereo pairing, uh, it's portable, ready to parte, up to four hours of wireless play, completely wireless up to a 30 foot range without the hassle of cords, and it's totally universal, works with any Bluetooth enabled device. Looking forward to it. Thank you so much, Rod. All right, I have two little boxes left. They're both so pretty and so cute. So I am gonna open this red one first. Let's see here. Alrighty. Good thing I have my glasses on so I can see. I also knocked my champagne over, well, not completely, but a little bit. So there's champagne all over my desk now. All right. <gasps> no, that's going right back in the box for a minute. Oh, what? Whoa, what were you thinking? Okay, I'm gonna do this one first and save that. I'm almost scared of that one. Oh my God, I like threw it away. Ah, what? Okay, have to like recompose myself. Okay, I'm gonna open this one. All right. <clears throat> Ooh, ooh, that's pretty. I can't even concentrate on anything now. That little box, oh my God. Okay, this looks like a scarf. It's beautiful. Is it a infinity scarf? It is. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. I'm gonna take my Louis shawl off and put this on. Uh. I need to have that thing cleaned. I've been wearing it a lot and I feel like it needs to be cleaned. All right, lovely. It's very soft. Is it like a metallic? I can't quite tell. It kind of looks metallic. I'm gonna take this little red box and put this big box on the floor so I stop knocking my champagne around. Man, what are you doing? Okay, so here is my beautiful new shawl or scarf, thank you so much. It's lovely. And it goes with the top I'm wearing too. Thank you, thank you. Okay, I'm like nervous to open this box now. <laughs> this is lovely. It's very um, soft and it's warm and perfect colors for me. It's the like neutrals and it'll look really nice with that inspired Chanel bag that I have. By the way, Rod, you are my Chanel guru and you are convincing me to start dabbling in Chanel. I'm thinking about a card case. I, I had a video where I talked about going into Chanel and looking at the card cases or coin cases, the zipped things. It was the same day that I went to look at the Louis Vuitton zipped coin and, uh, I wasn't feeling it, but I can't stop thinking about it. So I might have to go back. 
Okay. What? What? I feel like Jerusha, doesn't she say that all the time? What? Okay. There's something under this box. Kettle corn. It's hard to see. It's not really showing up. It says kettle corn. Oh, it says three ounces of chocolate kettle corn. That will be fantastic. I can't show this to the boyfriend because he will eat it. I love the popcorns like that. What is this? Okay. Ah, oh my God, there's even a little... <gasps> That's the thing from the thing. That's from the, um, that show in New York. What? Will McKayson had that um, on his video where he went to the show that's going on. Is it still going on in New York? And he picked this up at the little gift shop. How did you get one, Rod? <clears throat> oh, oh my God. That's cool. Just having that is awesome. Okay. Oh man. Okay. What is this? Oh my God. Look at that. And it's green. Have I ever even seen a green one? That is too cool. I was just watching your video the other day where you had, um, focus where you had all the luggage tags that you showed that you bought your Louis Vuitton haul. This is gorgeous. Um, what was I saying? Cause you moved and you had all the packages. I'm talking to Rod here, but a bunch of other people are watching this. So let me talk to the other people. So Rod had this video, you should go watch it on his channel, Doc Luxury. And he moved recently, so he hadn't been doing videos for a while. So he had all these things he'd collected in the time, in that span of a few months. And he had a bunch of luggage tags. And I was pretty, like, incredulous about how he even got them. Because if y'all remember, uh, if some of my other videos, I have tried to buy a small luggage tag at my local Louis Vuitton store, and they refuse to sell me one. So, how do you get all of them? You have an awesome essay, I guess. So, wow, oh my God, look at this. It's so pretty. Louis Vuitton Paris, made in France. It is this gorgeous green. Someone tell me the official name of this green, please. That is beautiful. And y'all might know this from watching my videos. My color scheme in the videos is like a black and white and gray with green accents. So this is perfect, perfect, oh my God. Oh, all right. Well, like compose myself here. Okay, I'm gonna get some champagne. I need, I need champagne after that, oh my God. Oh, oh my God, there's champagne everywhere. Uh, I have a pile of mail here, it's all over the tissue. Look how wet that tissue is, ah, yikes. Okay, so I just dripped it on my new luggage tag. I'm glad it's leather and not vaquetta. Vachetta, vaquetta. Oh, that is gorgeous. Oh my God. I don't even know what to say. I'm kind of speechless here. That is fantastic. So I have to find out how you got this from the New York show. Like, did you have somebody get it for you? Were you able to buy it somewhere else? Because I'm, I'm just curious. Yeah. I love it. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you so much for watching mine. Rod, I don't even know what to say. How can I thank you for this? This is fantastic. This is way more than I was expecting. I'm so excited about this. I'm like, I don't even know what to say. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Um, I think that's it for now. Vincent has been surprisingly silent. I haven't heard her once. What's going on? Oh, I know what's going on. So I think I mentioned in the video on her that I, I think she's a girl because 
I have these, uh, I would used to give her toilet paper tubes and, and uh, tubes from paper towels, and she would sit on them and fluff her feathers out like they were an egg. So I have a very long tube from a roll of wrapping paper that I put in her cage, <clears throat> and her cage is really big, and the tube is sitting like vertically from the bottom nearly to the top of the cage. She is sitting down there on the very bottom of the, of the uh, cage, here, I'll use this as an example. This will be my my wrapping tube thing. She's sitting on it like as high as she can get and she's all fluffed up. So she's busy nesting on her wrapping paper roll there. That's why she's being so quiet. Maybe I should keep that in there during all my videos. That's an idea. Although I know, and the blah, blah, I know a lot of people enjoy her too, but some people like it when she's more quiet. I don't know what to say. I'm just going to sign off. Remember to like, subscribe, and click the notification icon. Please, if you're not subscribed to the other Secret Santa YouTubers in this group, uh, please subscribe to them too because they are all fantastic and their videos are so fun to watch and very informative. And I hope that they enjoy their Secret Santa gifts as much as I have certainly enjoyed mine and I hope that they enjoyed um, doing the whole experience too and uh, sharing with, with each other because that's really fun. Um, thank you all for participating, everybody in the group, and thank you all for watching. I will see you soon. Have the happiest of holidays. Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, whatever you celebrate. Um, love you all and Happy New Year soon too. I'll see you next time. Have a great evening. Bye.